<laughs> okay, first in, guys. Yeah. Oh, first quarter. Welcome back to the channel guys, my name is Clay Wong and today I am very excited because we are going to be driving a race car on the street and it's no ordinary car, this is actually a JDM legend and guys this is it, this right here is a 2007 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 8 and well it's fully done up, it's got a stroked 2.2 litre forged 4G63 engine and it makes 400 kilowatts at all four wheels. That's bonkers that's literally 600 wheel horsepower in this very sleeper-esque if you could call an evo a sleeper build so you can't really tell there's a massive turbo at the front and it's been fully stripped out i can't wait to take you for a tour of this car but we've got my good friend stan and he's going to be taking us for a crack at this beast and i'm honestly so hyped right now and we've got stan the man or mr donnie yen oh my god come through brother you good ah. you've been practicing your kung fu yeah yeah <laughs> now good to see you it's been a minute so stan and i have known each other for about 10 years maybe yeah, about 10 years and he actually helped me build my k-swap on the civic eg oh i remember, you remember that, that? Oh. so i might actually insert a video here but that was a long time ago, but we've grown up. Yep. Stan's picked up a martial art hobby, yep. as you can see. <laughs> Donnie Yen. <Yen. laughs> and so he's brought one of his customer's cars. This thing is something else, man. Can you take us for a tour around this beast? Uh, so it's running a Honda B16A. Nah, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> Still love your Hondas, don't yeah. you? <laughs> Pretty much built for track. It doesn't even have a street cluster. It's got a Motec dash. Really? Yeah, yeah. So, um, this you is know, do sick. all the lap timings and all that. Are we going to do some of that today? Or? Uh, yeah, yeah, if you want. <laughs> Dude, we've got the perfect track out here yeah. in Mexico. Let's have a look at this thing, bro. Yo. This is pretty serious. Yeah, yeah. So, so no Recaros from factory. Yep, that's taken away. It's all fixed buckets, uh, Sparkos. So I can see that you've probably done a lap before I got here. Yeah. So um, I didn't do that. Um, one of our good friends did in uh, New South Wales. Sure. Undisclosed. <laughs> yep. But show us the back end real quick of this. Whoa, that is pretty hectic. I've never seen an Evo driven on the street with no interior well basically you've got the rear seats but yeah it's pretty yeah. wild so hence why the window's a little bit darker um true yeah. i didn't realize but as you can tell like this thing is pretty much stock in appearance if you didn't know any yeah, better if you drove behind you know you wouldn't really tell it's got evo 9 rear bars yep. uh, which looks really really good really vortex generator yep. big cannon yeah which yep. we love the silver also makes it quite of a sleeper. It is, it is. It it's it's it a very more. neutral colour, you know, nobody looks at you sort of colour. So if you're ever going to buy a supercar, don't buy silver. <laughs> yeah. Wait, wait. So is this car really loud then? Uh, yeah, a little bit loud. Yeah. Oh my God. I'm bit loud. sure as hell this thing is going to be lumpy if it's got a 2.2 in it. I love the T37 SLs. One of my favourite wheels. And if you look closely, guys, AP Racing Big Brake Calipers. Yeah, they're quite noisy Actually, when they warm up. So they're quite noisy. Yeah, yeah. They're going to yeah. be squealing. Squealing, yeah, yeah. And that draws a lot of attention. People think your car's something wrong. Uh, <laughs> That's true too. I mean, yeah, the normal traffic does. Yeah. Oh my lord, guys, this is actually so sick. I just love how it's very subtle, but yeah. you know, at the flick of a switch, or rather, yeah, look, stepping on the pedal. This it's thing, very responsive. Super responsive. Um, yeah. So it makes 400 kilowatts on E85. E85, that's right. Cow's built by Land Speed in New South Land Wales. Land Speed Racing. Yeah, Dang. Racing. I think um, uh, you should show us the engine bay, brother. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. Take the keys out. <laughs> don't, Never forget. Don't trust these cars. They're gonna lock themselves. Wow. Okay. This thing so is a beast. The engine bro. bay is all business. It's all uh, the business. All this business. is where all the there's magic no, happens, guys. There's no flashy, you know, bright co rocket covers. Right. Everything's for a purpose. Wow. Take a look at this thing, man. It's function, not form. That's right. right. Yeah, there's nothing showy about it. Uh, everything is just for a purpose. And I love that. See. I love that. Yeah. You know, sometimes we see a lot of show cars and they never get driven. Yeah. However, no. No. this is a build that definitely gets 
some track time. Oh, some it's seat I time. think mainly track time, but then on you know some sneaky Sundays, you know, take it out when the weather's nice. We know what you get up to. <laughs> <laughs> but this is sick, man. So run us through. I think you got an FP red turbo here. Yep, that's um, massive. So it's an LSR built, uh, 2.2 liter, 400 kilowatts. Uh, Heltec ECU, so it's been manifold, yeah. built, yeah. everything's been done on it. Yeah, pretty much. We could, we could go on forever here, you know, it's like... basically bulletproof, yeah? Uh, nothing is bulletproof, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, it looks, looks pretty darn yeah, sick. Yeah, yeah. so, um, That's we insane. could go on all day with the list, but the list goes on. And um, on, and on. It's, it's a very, very responsive car. Super response, you know? Jesus. Um, this thing is going to be a treat, guys. And obviously, it's in the legendary... 4G63 engine, which we love. That's right, not B69. No B69. <laughs> I mean, Stan loves the B16, but I also do. But this yeah. is just something different. Obviously, you've got all four wheels, yep. which means a lot of traction, a lot of grip. I can yep. see you've got some cheeky teens. Yep. Are they circuit racing master? Yeah, colors? yeah, they're, they're, they're mainly for the circuit. Uh, so Those yeah. are some big ticket items, and you can tell, guys, this thing doesn't play around. Honestly, I can't wait for this. I've had an Evo about five years ago, an Evo 9, which was nothing like I this. I remember that, the white one was it? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And uh, this is going to be a little trip down memory lane, but probably heightened 10 times over. And I'm so stoked there. So let's get into it, bro. All right, mate. I'm Key, let's go. <laughs> God, this thing sounds like a weapon. It's on what, 27? 272 cams. Oh man, I wouldn't have it any other way. Let's get strapped up. All right, all safe, secured. So what, what music you want to listen to? Blackpink or? <laughs> I want to listen to this thing. So I haven't seen Stan drive for about five years. Let's see uh, how he goes out here. We've got a nice stretch, as you can see. <laughs> was that like 20%? Yeah, I don't know. I didn't really look. I have to keep my eyes on the wheel. I mean, on the uh, on the road. On the road. <laughs> you've uh, lost Hands on the wheel. And you, the you've lost the plot already. The road. <laughs> <laughs> Dang! Wow. It stops. It goes. I wasn't even ready for that. <laughs> so we've got a few corners up here. This is going to be sick. Wow. Um, yeah, the last fast Evo that I drove was a crazy 4B11 Evo 10 with 450 kilowatts. I believe somewhere near that ballpark. But guys, this has the 4G11. Sorry, this has the 4G63. I'm losing the plot already. It's a B69. <laughs> <laughs> and it's actually a whole lot lighter than the Evo 10. Yeah. And this is a race car. Stripped. Nothing in here. Yeah. Does that even have aircon in here? I don't know. I never tried it. I don't think we did. Oh my god. So what is it like to drive this car stand? Uh, in my opinion, you need full concentration at all times. Uh, two hands on the steering wheel. I guess you're prepping me for everything that's yeah, going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know. the corner, um, fights really hard, the tyre's going to warm up a little bit more, the brakes are going to warm up a little bit more, but uh, other than that, it's a really good package. This is like fully set up for the track, the full modelist on this car is actually insane. Every single white line part, every single hard race part, this car has, and obviously it's a little taste of what this car could do. Yep. Just trying to hold on. hold on. Right. Yeah. You 
the good response sell. is just really, really just takes you by surprise. And this is why I love Evos. It's yeah. light, it's quick, it's agile, and it doesn't really look like a very, very serious sports car. No, it doesn't. Well, you know, that's why they're so successful at the time attack, the real time attack, the Evos. That's true. Yeah, I don't know, one of these days, I would love to go back into a sick little Evo. I think well, it's only right, right? Maybe one day we'll sell this. We'll see you. you sell me this. <laughs> oh man, I would love that. A little bit. <laughs> it's literally so addictive. It is. It's just on tap, anytime. You've got the power of a milk carton. <laughs> it's size, literally, 2.2 liters. Four cylinders of pure. Just can't hold yourself back. JDM power, literally. Always want to give it, but we can't. We're gonna be. We're gonna be good. We're gonna be good. I mean, you're the one that's bringing it out of me. <laughs> like you are starting this right now. No, no, we're gonna be good. It's too, too much. I can see you checking the rear view yeah. every single second. <laughs> <laughs> Drive back. <laughs> uh, after that, maybe not, but let's do it. Hey, is that yours? Yeah, oh my god, that's sick. Definitely on the cars, we're gonna have to do a video on this thing. If you can see, it is a crazy wide body top secret 35 GDR. Oh, look at that, that's nice. I'm gonna have to come back, but yes, I'm definitely gonna take you up on this offer to drive. Let's go, man. Oh, guys, this thing. It's bonkers. Hey, bro! Yo, I love your car! Nah, bro. Hey, thank you so much for staying tuned, bro. You too, Take right. care, you brother. Too. So, guys, we're going to be jumping in the Evo now. Hey, good luck, mate. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> so, signature Evo test. Turning circle. Turning circle. Not bad. So, I hope I can do this car justice for you, Stan. Yeah, yeah. So, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to concentrate. I mean, holding this camera. Everything, this car is alive. You, you, and you feel it. You really need, like, almost 100% concentration driving this car. Um, because it could do anything, like, at any time, if you don't pay attention. Okay, first same, guys. Yeah. Yo, this thing is gripping! First quarter! Oh my god, this is epic! <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> what 
honestly, you don't even need to go hard in this thing to enjoy the Evo. That's right. I think the fact that you're driving a race car on the streets is insane all in itself, and I absolutely love it. <laughs> oh, you know, the taste of that dose. Yeah. <laughs> I feel kind of like I'm in Tokyo Drift. Yeah. Obviously, when I'm drifting on the street, maybe in the next episode. Yeah. Yeah, let's do let's it. Do it. <laughs> Thanks so uh, much for that, brother. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. appreciate you for taking me on this crazy no, ride. Welcome, Having a look at this thing, driving it, honestly brings back so many memories. I love it. Just want to say a huge shout out to Stan from Remark Auto Buddy for helping me bring out this beast on the street. It has been a riot. If you guys have enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Let us know in the comments below what you think about this crazy beast and how we drove it today, obviously. And if you see it around, make sure you say hi. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. As well as that guys, subscribe to the channel and we'll see you in the next one. We've got a lot of exciting things coming. Take care, guys.